But the real light should also work. Because the grey cable goes... It isn't activated yet. We still have to do that. We're putting the real light on the back now, so it looks like we're making progress here. The scooter of course gets the super awesome headlight from us. Nico, how do you like our headlights? I think they are excellent. We could actually put the headlight in already. What do you want to put in? Are you working on the headlight right now? Yes, of course. That looks nice from the front. I think this headlight is very cool. In the past, if you wanted LED light, you always had to use those ugly headlights. But this one fits quite well. I'm invincible with a 1.5 square millimeter cable. The fork and steering head cover came back from machining. We had someone shorten the fork. The weld was opened up at the bottom and a piece of the fork was cut off. After that, it was sealed back in, so basically just like the original. The problem with this was that the custom paint job was then of course damaged at that point. We had that corrected by our friend Sebastian Attenberger. This looks really perfect, like the first painting. I will now try to install the batteries. For this we simply take two 6 volt batteries and connect them in line to get 12 volts. Now everything must be reassembled of course. First, I'll install our new SIP shock absorber. It's well suited for the PK version because of the shortened fork and the PK shock absorber. That way we can bring it a little lower at the front. The actual length of the fork is not determined by the stance tube, but by the length of the shock absorber. So if I only change the shock absorber, the angle of the rotary movement will also change. So we had the fork shortened to make it look nice and fitting. The shock absorber is now installed. If you want to use a hub from the new Grimaker disc brake, you must pay attention. You can't use the mount for the shock absorber and the brake caliper from the old one. The reason for this is that the diver drive has a different height, so that won't fit. This part here is quite old and was probably reinstalled in the 90s. Later, there was an update of the Grumeka disc brake. Of course, we also want to install parts that are compatible with this update, so this means that we will replace the anchor plate. Here, we can take an item from SIP. I'm just a little unsure whether it'll also fit with the KR automation rim, but I'll just test it. YouTube is just a fashion appearance. Yeah, that's not going to catch on here. We had the disc break here earlier, of which you hear good things, and people are also happy with it. The installation instructions of the disc started like this. The installation of the rotating disc is simple. I was looking forward to that, since we don't have much time. Then the instructions continued. You need some tricks though. Some tricks. This will be interesting. It is easy to assemble this disc if you have a lathe available. So I got a different disc brake. I thought it had to look cool and I only want to install nice parts that actually work. That's why I took the Discachati brake disc or in Bavarian, a Discachati. This is also a company that I'm very convinced of. 
it's already a good sign that no assembly instructions are included. When it comes to conversions, it's always cool to test whether the parts from the different brands really fit together. I've now assembled the Discachati brake disc, our hub. The Greenmaker brake anchor plate and the SIP shock absorber. It's going very well so far. Now I'll put on the KR automation rim. If this also works, I'll be very happy. Let's see. That's a good idea. What should I hold? We're going to install the fork now. I'll quickly get the steering bearing. I'll bring it really quick. Not the I'm going to get something quick, but... Now comes the part where I might need you. Hold the handlebars. Because we already have a lot of cables there, I'll take that down for a second. Nico, it's getting heavy. Okay. No, that didn't happen now, did it? What have you done now? I dropped the bearing ring and the ball flew out. No way. Quickly, now! Yes, Kel, I found the bearing ring. Robert holds the handlebars and you have the fork. Nice, the screwdriver will do the rest. We will now tighten the handlebars and try to lay the cables neatly. It will work. Will you let me know if you want to align it? What do you mean align? Are you already at it? Oh shit. Yes. Will you switch gears please? It doesn't work there. It doesn't work in the minus one range. Are you alright? How is it now? Now you're on three, four. Will you go to third gear again please? Then second gear, this is the fourth. That's the wrong way around. Shift back to second gear. And finally, to zero. Uh, I think I have to get up again. We'll see in a moment. It's like a time lapse. Reach out and touch faith. You said we could sign. But you should also be able to sing well. That was the rule. When he starts singing, I always hope he'll be in a bad mood again soon. So that it's quiet again. Hey, we're making really good progress. Yes, I think so too. I don't want to say anything, but we're almost done. We could just stop. Just two more screws. Then we'll go home early. Light indicators. Look here. But look here now. I am looking. You can now see very well that a Discachati brake disc and the SIP adapter are installed. The rim is also very nicely pierced. I quite like the combination, so it wasn't a mistake. It took a few nerves, but it still turned out very nice. I like that. There isn't much left to do. Does the brake have to work? What do we do next? Hang up the clutch cable. Yes, go. The brake. Okay, I'll hang up the clutch cable. As long as Nico isn't here, I can put the stage higher. Can't we just tell the truth? We're simply still drunk from yesterday. 
Hey guys, I was supposed to be moderating and the cameraman told me to be a little more ambitious. I'm supposed to be more motivated, but we had an internal celebration yesterday. And since we got the electrics almost completely finished yesterday, I was just happy and had two or three beers, or maybe eight. He always mumbles like that. But now back to seriousness. I get it. That doesn't fit. Hey guys, yesterday we finished the electrics as much as possible. We are well on schedule and are now in the final phase. The steering head cover still has to be attached and various attachments still have to be connected. The rear brake still has to be finished. I'm working on it right now. Jesko is working on the front brake. And if we hurry up now, we can get the vehicle ready today. So it should be ready for the custom show tomorrow. Nico, do you recognize this part? This is the man from the back swing arm. Oh no, it's closed in itself. Exactly, it's closed. Fun fact, the engine is already installed. But this part has to go around the traverse. That's why the engine has to be removed again, so we can put that around the traverse. It'll be quick. Here I drilled the holes in the carbon cover, which were slightly pre-embossed. I hit them surprisingly well, I'm quite happy with that. However, that doesn't mean it's a good fit already. You can't complain about that. Here I have the old and the new seat. The new seat is very similar to the old one, but with a shape update. But with the shape update, it is now made of carbon and blends even more beautifully with the shape of the frame. I just don't have a seat at the moment, or a seat cushion. The old seat cushion was color matched to the scooter, with lots of metal flakes in the design. Now I have to see if I can transfer that to the other seat without it looking weird. Ha. I've now went to the brakes and completed everything. The lid is also back on and the expansion tank is full. Down here everything is screwed tight again and I have already adjusted them. We're actually done here. Now I'm looking for a small path for down here. I'm sure Jesko knows where it is. Jesko? Do you happen to know? No, wait, I disassembled it myself and I should know what was on it. I don't remember what the screw looked like anymore. This is probably it. Here's a really big screw that kind of looks like MMW. A really thick one. I learned how to clean up from Jesko. I used to be really messy. Until Jesko explained to me that you can't work like that. Sounds very likely. We can use the cable tie again here. What's even worse, where do we mount the exhaust now? Come on, let's try it. And does it work? I can't get past it. Do you see that it's stopping there? We're putting in an 8-hole now. What do you say? Mark it. I'm totally on your side. Here we can screw in a flat screw. Then we can get closer. One moment. 
Where does it stop? Well, there is nothing we can do about that. Now the true customizer comes out. We'll saw this off and then bend it here. Then we place this here and since the hole is here, we can drill through that and we're done. Yes, that will be great. I will tighten the steering head cover. You have no idea what I'm up to and you don't care either. Be honest. Hey, want to smoke a cigarette? It will take him forever. Then we leave the lift up. Do not cut that out now. It's supposed to be a quick project, they said. Don't we have any deck chairs? We have deck chairs at Abgedreht. We have deck chairs at Abgedreht. Und wieder Jesko. Nico, you're an iron bender, right? That's still my first beer. I said iron bender. My father was actually an iron bender. It almost looks like we can start packing up. The side stand must still be built on it. I forgot. We need to tighten the brake pedal and still have to fix a thread. So the brake pedal thread and the stand still need to be installed. We already have the seat. You just have to put it on. It's easy. Not everything is 100% finished yet, but the scooter can stand halfway nicely. And he can make tricks. Yes, like sit, down and heal. That's okay for the custom show. He can make tricks. The stand is on. Smoke. Think about a knife, slowly cutting the old throat. Let it think about a girl, slowly putting on your coat. Lipstick on her lips, holy shit, she glows. Let it think about she dancing, but she's stepping on the toes. Now I realize that all these habits in a fucking dream. All these holes and all these pills, you can fast like it's some lean. Why you dancing me? Yes, you don't want a deck, so why you talking shit? Bitch, put me on the desk, I'm like shit, no stress. Hey, shit, God bless. Hey, shit, they always want more and even less. Chocolate chip cookies looking faded, watching movies, weak body looking bloody, dark water stay too muddy. Fuck with the hoes, come too close, get wrecked like hoes. Oreos, raid them hoes and plenty shows. Real gross, we sniff the shit, they overdose. Less most, holy shit, this is no swap and pop and thanks. Straight to a range, yeah. keep it, keep it low. Trying to change, eh? Hey.